Hey guys, um, today I'm going to react to Henry's Trap, the Chinese version. Um, sorry, hold on. Personally, oh, oh, personally, I, I did like the Korean version of the song, but my main intention for actually watching the MV was just to see Kyu Hyun. Kyu Hyun. Probably said that wrong, but. That was my main intention to see the video in the first place. The Korean video at least. Um, and then I watched an episode of Happy Together and Henry was on it. And I did not notice he was, you know, he was a foreigner. And um, I liked his style and everything, you know, I liked the way he presented himself in such a different manner. So I was like, you know what, I'll give Henry a try. And I liked him. He was very charming. He's a really nice guy and everything. I make it sound like I'm gonna date him or something. That's not the case. <laughs> but, so I was excited and the Chinese version was released just recently. So, um, yeah, I'm usually not a big fan of the Chinese version of songs, of, um, Korean songs. Sometimes it does sound good, like, um, Exo's Growl. I thought the Chinese version sounded way better than the Korean version because, like, Chinese songs have that, like, that, like, you know, it has that and in EXO's growl, I think the use of the Chinese language made it sound like much more of a smooth sounding song and it went well with the choreography. So, um, excuse my rambling, but without further ado, let's react to Henry's. Trap featuring QQ and Taman. Chinese version. <laughs> Here we go. Don't forget the homeboy can play the piano. Don't we all just love someone who can play an instrument and sing to us? Even though it's through the internet. You'd be hitting some hard strings.
can't. So, <laughs> I know the MV was the same, obviously, but the Chinese version sounds way, way, way better than the Korean version does sound. Um, I did notice that it happens a lot with um, SM songs. Usually the Japanese version or the Chinese version sound a lot better than the Korean version. Um, sorry if I kept looking at my eye touch, I just got an update that it's funny because I just recorded Defcon's video earlier and he just released the new teaser for an upcoming song and I'll probably do that when the actual MV comes out. I'm not a big fan of doing teasers because they're so short and there's really not much to react to, so there's really no point of trying to react to a, like, two-minute video or less than two-minute video. Probably even, like, 20 seconds. You can't put much thought into that 20 seconds of a video. Oh. oh. Nothing important. But, I don't know if you noticed, when I kind of, like, wipe my eyes, I have this, um, thing where I don't know, when someone sings really good, and like you can feel the passion in their voice, like it just hits you, and then you get all emotional, but I probably wasn't even going to cry anyways, but the Chinese version of the song is amazing, and it's been a while since I actually watched the MV itself, and I liked it as usual, sorry, I don't even know what's going on with my light here, um, the MV was good, I did notice, again, I mean, the fact that I'm watching it for a second time gives me, like, a second chance to really, you know, analyze the MV itself. Um, <coughs> <coughs> sorry, uh, that was actually supposed to be a laugh, but I guess it sounded like I was dying. <laughs> um, I did notice that Henry kind of looks like, um, Thank You from Infinite at certain parts and then there was this one part where he kind of just looked like a sheep and I thought that was really cute. I was like, oh, shit. <laughs> a sheep. Um, again, the first time I watched the MV, I did not recognize the choreography at all. I wasn't too keen on the choreography. I was kind of just like more focused on the fact that this is a new artist that I've never heard of before when I first watched it. And I was kind of like, okay, you know, let me just give this a try and mainly because uh, the first time I watched the MV, my main focus was waiting for q to come out, and that's all I waited for, and that was towards the end of the MV. And his part was amazing. Nonetheless, nonetheless I remember the whole handkerchief dance. That was some good choreography. It's not that easy to dance with a piece of cloth, although it does sound like it is, you know. The fact that they can get the cloth or manipulate the cloth to move in the same way as everyone else and keep it properly in sync is not easy to do. So props to them for that. Um, what I did find ironic is 
the fact that the song is called Trap, and I do know it's about, um, being in a relationship, and he's basically trapped because he doesn't know what to do, you know, the relationship's over, and he's trapped inside him, and his feelings are trapped, you know, he wants to just let everything go, but he can't, he can't forget the girl, which is why she keeps vanishing here and there, like she's some kind of badass. I did notice, like I was saying, how it was very ironic is the fact that the song is called Trapped and as you all know, in SM videos, they're constantly, constantly using these box sets and, well, Henry knows he's trapped. <laughs> At least the poor boy knows he's trapped in that box for quite a while <laughs> until he branches out. But I mean, he's part of Super Junior, so they'll probably upgrade from a box. A room? I don't know, they'll probably upgrade. So, yeah, overall, I prefer the Chinese version. I do prefer the Chinese version over the Korean version, so I like that much of it. And I do like Henry. I do like Kyu Hyun, I like Kamen. So, this was actually really refreshing. And, except for the fact that. I almost near got emotional towards the end, but it was refreshing. I enjoyed the Chinese version of the song. So yeah, if you enjoyed this, watching this video as much as I enjoyed making it and <laughs> making fun of myself, almost pretending to die, then please like and subscribe. I will have more videos coming up soon. Um, I've been getting a but a load of updates how there's been a lot of teasers released and I'll just wait for the actual MV to come out but in the meantime if you do have any videos that you'd like me to react to I personally haven't seen a lot of K-pop videos so if you have any videos uh, <laughs> so yeah if you have any videos that you want me to react to you can leave me a comment in the comment box below Tweet me on Twitter, Instagram me, Facebook me, any music communications like I always say in my videos. I'm open to it. So, um, yeah. Thank you all for taking your time out to watch my videos. Um, yeah. I will see you all later. Bye.